How are we doing everyone? Sam here, United People's TV. Now, Manchester United, we lost 2-1 against Huddersfield at the weekend. Our first loss of the season. But we can't rest on those laurels because on Tuesday night, we play Swansea City in the League Cup. We are currently the League Cup holders. Of course, last year at Wembley, Manchester United beat Southampton in the League Cup final. Thanks to Zlatan Ibrahimovic's late header. And now we're trying to hold on to the cup, which Jose Mourinho will definitely place a lot of importance on. A lot of you may say, look, Jose, just rest your team, rest a few key players. We're playing Spurs on Saturday. This is Jose Mourinho we're talking about. He doesn't do that. It's always one slight criticism I had of his teams at Chelsea. They always had burnout come February, March. Maybe that will be the case this year, but maybe not. But here's our match preview and predicted start 11 for that game at the weekend. Now, going into it, Swansea, they lost 2-1 to managerless Leicester City at the weekend. I think they're currently 15th. Paul Clement's team are struggling. But so were Huddersfield before they played Manchester United at the weekend. So let's not say that means that Manchester United are going to win. It just means that things aren't going that right for Swansea at the moment. Renato Sanchez not having the sort of impact what Swansea fans may have hoped for. I still think Renato Sanchez would have been a good signing for Manchester United, but that is something completely different. But heading into the game, there's not too much to preview that you already don't know. Manchester United, we need to bounce back from that Huddersfield game with a victory against Swansea because going into this Spurs game, which will be one of our hardest games so far this season, we need to come off the back of that confident and after a win. So here's my predicted 11 for that starting game. I'm going to put David De Gea in goal. I don't think he needs to be rested. I don't think goalkeepers ever really need to be rested. I think it's just an excuse from a manager when he ever does rest one. But at right back, I am going to go for probably Matteo Darmian. Maybe give Antonio Valencia a rest. These are the sort of games where you do rest him in. Now, centre-back partnership, I'm going for Chris Smalling and Victor Lindelof. Lindelof will want a game where he can immediately put behind him what happened against Huddersfield. Swansea in the League Cup is perfect for that. Phil Jones is injured. Eric Bay, he's not quite ready to return, and neither is Rojo. So Chris Smalling is effectively definitely going to start. And at left back, why not? I'm going for Luke Shaw. I want to see Luke Shaw come back in and for us to stop playing a 32-year-old right winger as our left back, or however old Ashley Young is. As good as Ashley Young has been at points this season, Luke Shaw is our single best left back at the club. So for fuck's sake, start playing him, please, Jose. Now, centre mid partnership, I'm going to go for Herrera and Matic. I'm going to stick to the 4 2 3 1. I don't think Paul Pogba is going to, even Pogba is ready slightly for this. I don't think he's going to be used. Marouane Fellaini is not ready either. And Michael Carrick, maybe Michael Carrick will play. Who would you rather play? Let me know in the comments whether you would start Carrick there. And for a, I'm going for a 4 2 3 1. So we're going to have a right winger, a left winger, a number 10, and de definitely Romelu Lukaku up front. I'm going to go for Mikatarian on the right hand side. Juan Mata in the middle and Anthony Martial out on the left. It could be any number of players. It really could. And I don't think it matters. What matters is that Manchester United need to make sure that we put this Huddersfield game behind us and win against Swansea on Tuesday. Because we, if we draw or lose against Swansea, we're going to head into that game against Spurs in really bad form in terms of the last two games. The confidence will be lower, and that's going up against one of the best strikers in the world in Harry Kane. And our defence and our team has to be on point if we're going to try and beat Mauricio Pochettino's Tottenham Hotspur on Saturday. And that has to start with a win against Swansea on Tuesday. That's it for the prediction and the starting 11 prediction video. Let me know what you think in the comments below. As always, ladies and gents, please drop a like on the video. Subscribe to United People's TV if you're new. We'll see you soon. Take it easy.